Hey guys, what's going on? That was Mocha Man the cat in the reloading room. Anyway, on the RCBS Junior, the Junior 3, you have the handle down here which hangs down. Okay? And then you push it up, and then you see this? This pushes the ram up into the die to do your work. So you're always forcing up. You're always raising the handle up, right? And then when you let go of the handle, of course it drops. You know, then you can do your work, put your shell in and out, blah, 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 blah. I was wondering, though, there is a hole on the other side. And I was wondering uh, if you just take this block and flip it around so this is doing the same protrusion out the other side because there's the exact same hole back here. This way, when you push down with the handle, if it's in the other configuration over here, right, there's a hole right here. Once you push down, this ram is actually up. So, um, with the weight of the handle, you see where my thumb is at. With the weight of the handle over here, this, this would keep the ram up all the time. And then I'd have to hold it up with my knee or something to... Uh, you know, take the shell out or whatever. You know, just be the opposite of what of what of what is now. So my question is, is there like, cause see, there's a hole right there. You you put the handle in right here. Here's the hole. See, so when you put the handle in, when you let the handle just hang, that ram is up. So I'd have to hold this handle up, right, to change the shell out and everything, and that's going to be a pain. So is there something to keep that up? Or I just have to hold it with my knee, and then do I have to switch this uh, block over here? I just have to turn that around to the other side. All right, so let me know. Uh, I appreciate it. Thanks, and have a good day.